Michelle. Welcome to my channel, Grateful Creations. My goodness, I miss you guys so much. I was on a four day trip that turned into a five day trip and it was lucrative, but <laughs> wasn't without um, some excitement. Let's just put it that way. Anyhow, my colors tonight, I've got them all laid out here. I've got Little Piggy in Galaxy, and this is mixed with Amsterdam in Payne's Gray. This Payne's Gray is less of a blue and it's more of a gray. I have Amsterdam Greenish Blue. I have Artist Loft um, Cobalt, Metallic Cobalt Blue. I have three golds. I have the Deco Art Metallics in 24 karat gold, Atelier in Interactive in um, rich gold, and I, that's what I started out with, and it was a little too dark, so I added the iridescent gold fine. And then, of course, I have to have the sparkle, so I got that. And this is um, Amsterdam Acrylics in, um, hang on a second, Pearl Violet. And I mixed that with Little Piggy, this Little Piggy in Pinwheel, and also in Sequins. So those have some um, purple tones to them. And I know that these react really well next to a black, and this is close to a black. So actually, I think I did, I did add some Meaden um, acrylic to this as well. So, and then the last, um, we have this little, blah, 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 this little piggy in a uh, ball gown, and that is mixed with golden iridescent pearl. And I think I put just, a, oh, I put a touch of deco art satin enamels in with the, um, the pearl. So I am excited. I couldn't wait to finish this properly because what I want to do is make sure that um, all the edges are sanded and all that good stuff. And um, I have my turntable. So I had to pin it kind of special underneath so that it would fit properly. And let's see. And it still is, it still is. I'm gonna do a ring pour tonight. Um, sorry if you can't see the whole thing. Uh, I've got a new clamp for my phone and it kind of wiggles a little bit. So hopefully you don't end up like all the way down here. <laughs> So this 24 inch by 24 inch gallery wrapped canvas from Artist Loft will take about 20 ounces of paint. I am, oh shoot. start with a 16 ounce cup and the first colors I'm going to put in I I mix these colors up about two three hours ago so they should be good to go um, and I did do a drip test although oh there's a bug inside the paint yep. that's why I wanted to come out and get <laughs> get it done now all right and I've got a lot of this white. Oh, oh no, I did tell you guys. Did I tell you guys I had the, um, what was it, Liquitex in greenish blue? Yes, with the, um, this is Liquitex greenish blue with the TLP in mermaid. Okay, so I'm gonna start with black, a good amount in the bottom. I want a dark center, so I'm gonna go with this and then I'm going to put some of the pearl and then I'm going to put some gold on top of the pearl and then I'm going with I'm going to put a little bit more pearl in I'm going to put some pearl in between gold 
And then this is the Artist Loft, metallic cobalt blue. And then this is the um, Liquitex bright aqua green. And a little bit of the pearl. And a little gold. You know what, I haven't, oh geez. Now I'm gonna put the black in. A good amount. I should have put this in the bottom. Those two next to each other are gonna be stunning. Actually, I'm gonna put a little bit more black in too. again with this. I might have to pour two cups. I'm going to put some of this next to that too. I love pinwheel. Pinwheel's like my favorite. Oh, you're not invited to the party, dude. Nope. Off, off you go. Um, a little bit of off to the side for now and I do want to pour into something I made the mistake of pouring into pouring right on the canvas without pouring into um, a, a puddle of something and it was not good I ended up with squiggly lines all over the place so I'm going to I'm gonna pour into the gold there we go I need to take my watch off <laughs> I never wear a watch except for at work. <laughs> All right, guys, this is exciting. All right, here we go. Oh boy. Voila! That is gorgeous around there. God, I wish I would have put more of that in. Ooh! So, should I pour another one over top? I don't think so. I like that center. I really like that center, and I love these, the aqua. Oh, geez. I'm just loving it, period. All right, now I'm going to make sure that this is thin enough. It is still thick. Yeah, it's thick. And we're gonna spin this baby. like it's tilting over a little bit on that side so I'm going to move it ever so slightly before I put my sister painting. I love doing ring pours. Sarah Mack and Nina Villegas and Gina DeLuca all have inspired me over the years. I just love their work. You guys should check them out. I don't have a spectrum.
that it really has to be, especially if we're spinning it. Oh, what the heck, let's just go this way for a little bit. And then we'll bring it back. Oh, all that purple is gonna be on the edge and I'm gonna lose that. Darn it. I should have layered differently. Wonder, it's not too late. I could do another center. I'm gonna do that. Guys, you're gonna think I'm crazy, but I'm gonna do that in a very fresh cup. Do a little one. because this is my workspace. I have tiles down here, so it's really super easy to clean. And that's, I'm gonna stick with that. I'm gonna move it over a bit. Wow, there's some wild like speckles happen in there on those fingerlings. Okay, I'm just gonna go for it before I lose my nerve. Here we go. Oh, it's going more to one side. I'll stop it. Tilt it over. Those are some wild looking uh, cells there. So once I figure out how to do this um, turntable correctly, not that it's really bad right now, um, I'm going to do a video on it. But there are power tools involved. I'll, I'll let you know that right now. I'm not sure I like this. I'd have to do it over again. It's not really what I was going for. Hmm. I don't like that it came off this edge first. All right, let me just give it a spin. I might end up with some negative space. I wanted that much negative space in the 
from that negative space with the black in the center, although it has that beautiful um, galaxy in there. We'll see. Give it a chance, Michelle. That's really beautiful. This is cool. I can walk it and tilt it. It's the little things in life. How did I get white paint on that one area? And I see a bug. I dripped. That's a slow tilt. got too much black in the center. Oh my god, I'm going to be doing it again? I have the paint. Oh, I love this out here too. Shoot. It's got too much black in the center. Yep. Alright, one more cup. the teeniest bit of pearl. I mean the teeniest. Then I'm going to put purple. It's not really purple, it's um, but I'm going to put some black. And that'll be the rest of it. And then, um, yeah, I'm going to put the, can you guys even see me? Oh, well, look at that. It's not pretty. Oh my gosh, there's some really beautiful gold cells on the et on the um, edges here. Maybe I can do this again.
there we go. And I still poured it off center. <laughs> We're gonna have some pearls though, some beautiful gold pearls coming up. So pour all that gold in there. I don't know. Now that it doesn't look like there's enough contrast. All right, let me get a torch it. I'm gonna let it sit for a minute. Let it develop a little bit. Here's the torch. I want to center this a little bit better. At least bring it down a little. There we go. See, I was going the other way. Let's do this now. Pretty. All of the all of the good stuff's at the top, and there's really nothing here at the bottom, so I am going to let it sit for a moment, torch it again, and see what else. I can see some stuff in here, but it's like kind of embedded almost. <laughs> this is kind of cool. I really like it. I am gonna do another one with a deep center, not as deep as that, the other one, but, wow, this is really cool. Um, it looks like some of the stuff is gonna come up here. One more spin. Wait a minute, let me, why do I always say let me? Of course you're going to let me. Uh, let me do this. Let me do that. Are you going to say no? No, Michelle, you can't. It's really super shiny. Super shiny. exactly what I wanted. That dark part to end up at the bottom. Yes! Mission accomplished. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. So when it dries, I'm hoping that this all, I mean, it it sparkles in a way that you can't even imagine. It, oh, I just love it. Now I just love it. I love it. 
I absolutely love it. I got those corners off. I'm going to give it um, a quick, um, I'm gonna remove the paint from the underside to stop it. You wanna stop your paint from flowing over, otherwise it'll pull it and it'll change the, um, change the composition. Exactly what I was looking for. Exactly. I can't even tell you. It's exactly what I was looking for. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Now there's a lot of paint here. I'll be able to collect that and um, not waste it. There's a little bit on the floor and some on me. <laughs> but I'll be able to collect that paint and use again. I am so excited. There might be some more gold cells coming through. There's like a, one, looks like an eyeball. One little blue cell coming up there. It's so funny. This fluid art is just so much fun. are pretty cool in straight cords. Me like Alright guys, I'm going to give this a little bit of time to sit and then I'm going to come back and show you the wet results and then tomorrow the dry, well it won't be tomorrow, it's going to take a little while for this thing to dry. But, uh, Very, very pretty. My sides are gorgeous. It's still flowing over, so I you want to do this a couple of times to make sure. Yeah, it's still flowing over. Especially since I spun it, I think. Oh, I'm very happy. Very happy. I'm gonna be doing a lot of things on this spinner. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Get over it. All right, I am going to leave you guys for right now. That is it. I hope I'm not filming in a weird um, speed. If I'm filming in low speed, I'll just, oh, well, no, I can fix it. I can fix it. Yeah, see, I can see some of the uh, colors starting to come up. So this will change and I'll be back. Hey guys, this is it. Barely fit it in. I'm thrilled. Oh my goodness. Oh, see the bugs follow the light. Look at that. Look at those TLPs. I'm thrilled cute little cells that came up. There's black centers. And this is my favorite cell right there. That was the one that looked like an eyeball at first. And I don't mind that this is, um, doesn't have as much contrast as I might have wanted, but um, it kind of almost adds to it. I really love I thought I would have, especially with all that gold I put in, but they're there. And there's the gold that I poured into it. And then, yeah, I'm liking this. Really liking it. Sparkles. It just shines. The colors blended really beautifully. Center. So cool. Oops, there's a bug. So I'm so glad I made the spinner. Still trying to get up as high as I can. 
Um, please be safe and create. Please like, share, and subscribe. And if you see a piece that you'd like to make your own, please email me at gcfluidart at gmail.com. Ciao for now, guys.